right guys and girls, this is Pixel and today I've got a video that I am so, so excited to film. My biggest turbo crate opening probably of all time. I doubt I'm ever going to be able to top this. I've traded a lot away for these crates and a couple of them were given to me by viewers on stream. So thank you so much to all of you. But we have got 204 keys. And 54 turbo crates. And you know me, I like things to look mathematically pleasing. So we're going to get down to 150 keys, okay? And to do so, we're going to open 54 turbo crates. So I will delay no further. We start on a mystery. Let's end on a mystery in the first crate. Let's, let's see if we can do that. Come on. The Haywire, okay, okay, and uh, also I'm going to trade up everything I get in these turbo crates in this video. I'm a bit worried, uh, I wasn't going to record this till I got my new PC, because right now it's being rebuilt as I speak. Um, you're watching this in the future, I don't know when you're watching this, quite a few days after. Um, but yesterday my, P my old PC overheated three times and just shut down, and if that happens today, my recording's gone. Um, I wasn't going to risk it, but I was just so excited to open these crates, and I've opened the window, that's why I've not got the light on to not add any extra unnecessary heat, to try and keep it cool in this room. A kawaii. 10 out of 10, thank you very much. So I'm going to try and keep it cool, just so this recording lasts for like half an hour, and then honestly, my computer can do what it wants after that, I just want this video to be fine. So we started off with two rares, not a lot to, to talk about. In this video, what I'd like, I wouldn't mind very rares in crates at this point, because turbo crates are still quite new, and very rare trade-ups can lead to the the amazing painted endo. So we got, that, that was... There was some good stuff in that spin, but we got some septum wheels, which like I was just talking about, very rares are good because you can trade them up and get painted endos. I would love a mystery decal in a turbo crate, um, I'm yet to get one. I did get a mystery decal at the time of recording last night on Quemsy's stream before my computer died, and I was really excited, and it was a labyrinth. A vector, I'll take that, vector is one of the nicest very looking rare decals to have graced the game with its presence in my opinion. I think, I think it looks really nice. It does look kind of like labyrinth. To be honest, just with, with a little V in the front, I'd probably wear that over Labyrinth nowadays. I just think it looks really clean and really nice. So now, four out of the way, two very rares, two rares. We've got 50 now. Let's do this. Man, I'm excited. I honestly have no idea when I'm uploading this because at the moment, for me, I've recorded up to Saturday with my Superstition crate opening and I haven't done anything else after that. So whether I'm going to do a double crate opening on Saturday or whether I'm going to save this for some time in the future, I honestly do not know. I just couldn't wait any longer to open these crates. So... Uh, we don't really want the, uh, the aqueous though. That's kind of like my kryptonite in this crate. That'd be a really cool um, decal, kryptonite, or or a boost trail, or even a mystery decal. Kryptonite. That that's got a name that could suit, I would say, anything. Even paint finish. You could have like a fractal kind of crys crystallized sort of uh, thing. So you know, Rocket League. If you need ideas, uh, hit me up with that employment. Uh, I can I can work part time for you because. I do, I do YouTube as well, as you can tell. <laughs> um, Alright. There's the beautiful, there, <laughs> there's the beautiful decal. I like to think, like, when you open, see, this is the thing. When you, I, I'd often open, like, turbo crates in little five crate chunks. We've already opened more than that, and there's been nothing to scream about. But you'd hope with over 50 crates, you get something good. Either a painted endo, a painted exotic wheel, or a mystery decal. It's got to be one of those three. Come on, surely. Just going to hit us. Hit us with the Suji. Of course, there'll be loads of trade-ups because let's say there's 10 very rares and like 30 rares. That's three very rare trade-ups right there. So there are plenty of trade-ups. And, and obviously, this crate, very rare trade-ups are more valuable than any other crate because you can get painted imports and such things. So they, that's a good dynamic they've added to this crate. I like it. You don't have to waste loads of imports on trade-ups. And it makes rares a tad more valuable. But when you get the Heiwa, like that just looks weird. That icon... It, I, it looks so strange. I'm not going to go into it. It just looks really weird. Uh, I'm not going to do any superstitions this time, although they did work really well for me uh, in my recent superstition crate opening. Um, but not this time. We're just going to sit back. Open the crates. Get a furry at least. There we go. Got a furry. That's good. I can deal with that. I think after I do the import trade-ups of this video, I'm not going to trade up any um, endos because they're still way too valuable to trade up individually. I'll just trade up tachyons and furries. After I do those import trade-ups, I'm probably not going to do any more because the exotic wheels painted aren't as valuable really as, as, as we would have thought. I did get uh, orange painted roulettes in a stream in an import trade-up, which is my first and only import turbo trade-up painted exotic wheel. However, they look very, very similar. Basically identical to the normal roulette. Um, it just looks slightly thicker, I guess. Uh, and that kind of sucks. You know what I mean? Like, like Voltaic wheels, for instance, when they're orange, they look clearly different. They look cool, but the roulettes look basically the same. We get a tachyon. Is it painted? It could be painted. Maybe, maybe crimson? Maybe green? I'd like a green sort of tachyon. 
Normal. Okay, that's good. That's fine for a trade-up then. 42 crates remaining. Let's go. Let me just check the old uh, temperature. Okay, the temperature on my PC was 26 degrees when I started recording. It's now 25.6. I think the window out there is helping me out. We shouldn't overheat. I think that was the problem. Um, still recording all fine. Everything's fine. Let's keep going. Honestly, like I said, as soon as this video is done, I've got the files and they're safe. I'll feel a little bit better. All right. Come on. Come on. I'm, I'm going to close my eyes. I know I wouldn't do many superstitions, but I'm going to close my eyes this time. And cover them. So I know I'm not looking. I love the Suji. I do. I do. I, I really appreciate it. Um, it just, it looks like something you'd see on the wall in a FIFA Street game. You know what I mean? It's just, it's not what you need on your vehicle. You know, you're trying to show, hey, look, my phone just went off. <laughs> I spent money on crates. I, I'm, I'm addicted to the game. You don't want to look like a graffitied wall on your vehicle. You know what I mean? Uh, it's just not what you need. Come on. Octane Griffin, I've had enough of you. I've had enough of you. Let's get out of the way of rare decals. Very rares at this point. Throughout, throughout the crate opening, I'll take very rares because that's a trade-up in itself. Impulse, I'll take. But surely, not the aqueous man. Surely, a 20XX and a Tora. Like, one of those two. I've never had a Tora in my life. I had a 20XX. We all know the fate of that. We don't, we don't talk about that anymore. Um, for obvious reasons. I got a tad angry about that situation. Uh, but I've never had a Tora. Maybe we could get a Tora. I'm not asking for much. We get a Kalos wheel, but it's just not, not what you need. They're fine. Like, to people who don't open turbo crates, um, they're great for trading. But I open turbo crates. Quite a few of them, might I add. So let's, let's go. I'm going to put the controller down and have some sip, a sip of water. The water crate. <clears throat> Kawaii. I love the kawaii. It's my favorite. I like these videos. I do like crate openings. Like, there are there are the superstition crate openings. There's the 50-50 the crate openings, the forfeit crate openings. But I like the chilled crate openings where I don't have to cut it up loads. I can just sit and talk with you. It's like I'm, it's like I'm chilling with a friend, just talking, having fun. We get the Heiwa again. <laughs> oh, man. We've had, we've had, what, a Tachyon, a Furry, and a Kalos wheel. That's not great. Okay. Okay. No reaction crate. <clears throat> no reaction crate. Why am I making this a superstition crate opening? I think I'm just desperate for something. Anyway. We're moving on. We are moving on. Alright. Come on. Come on, Rocket League. Certified. Yay! Okay, let's let's do another superstition. Uh, why not? Start on the mystery, end on the mystery. Come on. No! I, I full on thought. Great. That really, really hurts. They're like, hey, it's painted. That's kind of good. We started on the mystery, and we were, we were. Uh, I think that's about as close as you can get to a mystery decal without landing on one. I think that right there, that what you just witnessed. There was a twenty XX under that. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we've uh. We've just been truly screwed by the game. One away from the mystery decal twice in a row, only to get two rare decals. Please. I'm not looking. I can't take it anymore. Rocket League, please. <coughs> oh, well. Whoo, okay. Okay, come on, Takumi Aqueous. Let's, uh, yeah. Let's, let's, uh, let's get out of here. Start on the mystery right there. End on the mystery right there. Tora. I'm not even asking for 20XX now. I'm asking for a Tora. Come on. I'll take an endo at this point. We got one away from the mystery decal, which kind of sucks again. But at least it was an endo and not a rare, uh, a rare or anything like that. It does look nice. The endo does look nice. I maintain that. And it's all right for gameplay. Um, it's all right. So, come on. Let's go. What's going to be? Hmm, hmm, hmm. Zenosplash, I'll take a Zenosplash, okay, okay, I'll take a Zenosplash. <coughs> oh, my throat, oh, <coughs> guys, man, I'm, I'm dying. This crate luck is appalling. How many crates have we opened? Uh, 25. We're nearly halfway through. We haven't really got anything. You know, we've had an endo. We've had the Griffin. We've missed the Mr. Decal, like, twice. Very, very close. 
Three times, actually. We were, we were one away. <sighs> I can't look. I'm going to look at the controller. I'm going to look down. I'm going to look at the very bottom of the screen. Ugh. Oh. No. <laughs> That's not what I need. I don't need the... Look, we're getting so many red decals. We're getting absolutely screwed. Come on. Rocket League, honestly, if you're listening, please help me out here. Please. Griffin, okay, you know what we need? We need some like the video luck. Last Turbo Crate opening I did, we got over 8,000 likes. Let's try and beat 8,000 likes. That is basically the most likes I've ever asked for on a video. I think I said 10,000 likes for 100,000 subscribers on the, on the Red Voltaic giveaway, which we did get. Can we get past 8,000 likes on this video? And if we do, I think we're going to get something good. I promise you we'll get something good. Like the video for a mystery decal or a painted exotic in the next 26 crates. Let's see if the Pixel Army can bring me some luck. I'll give you five seconds. One. There's my phone. Two. Three, four, five. If you've liked the video, thank you so much for the luck. This is the 26th uh, crate. Well, it's not the 26th crate. We've got 25 after this. So, yeah, that didn't make sense, but you get what I mean. After this, we'll have 25 crates. And that's where the fun stuff happens. The final 25. So, thank you for liking the video. Now sit back, relax, and enjoy the crate luck as we get something insane right here. Maybe not right now, but in the next 15 minutes. <laughs> okay. I mean, we've still got trade-ups as well, so we could get some good trade-up luck if we don't get any good crate luck. Because the Suji, that's at least the third time I've got that in this video. And Rocket League, that one thing they do exceptionally well is making the rares look look a way that just makes you really frustrated when you get them. You know? Uh, you get a rare, it's not a good rare. It's never a good rare. The funny book was kind of good, but its name just kind of annoyed you. We get a furry. That's good. That's good. I'll take an import paint finish. We're definitely having multiple trade-ups, maybe even two import trade-ups by the end of this, which would be really, really cool. Uh, but we've definitely got a load of very rare trade-ups as well, and of course rares. We could get some painted septums, but I don't really like the septum wheels. I just, I don't know. I, I Yeah, I really don't like them. The color on them doesn't show too well. Um, like when they're painted, it could just be a little bit around the rim of the wheel. Some of the painted wheels, the, 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 like the spokes are colored as well, and they look really cool. But some of them, they really don't change that much. Like my orange roulette wheels, which look exactly the same. Ah, <sighs> Come on. Let's go. Some white Kalos wheels. That'd be nice. Tachyon, I'll take it. Is it going to be painted, though? Is it going to be painted? I think this is the only item you can't tell if it's painted on the spin. You have to wait for it to come out of the car. But it's not. So that's another trade-up. Okay. I feel like we're going to get a mystery in the next seven crates. Okay. Next seven. I'm just feeling it. I'll take a furry. I'll take a furry. Definitely. Definitely take. Did we just get furry, tachyon furry? I'm not sure. I know we got another furry recently. I know we got a tachyon just now. But yeah, the next seven from here, all the way down to the lucky number 13. One of these seven, I think it's going to be a mystery decal. You heard it right here. Thank you for liking the video. Thank you so much for supporting me um, in these videos because have we just got four imports back to back? If so, the crate luck is unreal. Um... It's not painted, which is fine. I'm, I'm going to have to watch that back. I don't know if it's four back-to-back. -back. I know we got... I'm pretty sure we got three back-to-back -back now. But I don't know if it was four. Um, but yeah. That's that's pretty good. But yeah, in all honesty, um, I use the likes. The like ratio. Uh, and the amount of likes to see how well you like... How much you like these videos and whether I should continue them. So the reason I'm doing this is because the last one did get thousands of likes. So if, the, if you do want me to continue these types of videos, that's what you should do. You should leave a like and let me know... That way, because I, I honestly do look at the ratings, I look at the comments, and stuff like that. So, I said the next seven, so we've got five more crates for my feeling to be true. That's just the number that kind of came out when I said I was feeling it. That's the number that sort of was, was brought to my mouth without me really thinking about it. We've got an endo. We're getting so many imports right now. It's not painted, um, but that's certified. I had a feeling that would be certified. I was thinking in my head striker, but let's be fair, it's probably not a striker. Um... But hey, the imports are flowing. Uh, I'd rather that than exotic, so that's fine. Yeah, the kawaii. Uh, yeah, we were we were we were owed a rare, I suppose. Um, how many crates have we got left in the Magic Seven? That little group. We've got three more. Okay. Okay. All right. Let's go. Three more. Oh, that 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 lagged a bit. Is that going to be good? Tachyon again! What is going on? This is this is actually insane. 
This is crazy. Is this going to be painted? Certified. We, we've had three tachyons, like three furries, and two endos, I think. That's eight imports out of 54. That's one in... That's nearly... That's, that's better than one in seven, which is pretty good. Hey, wah. My dude. Welcome back. That just... That fish, it just looks so weird. I don't... I'm not a fan. I think it's a fish. Okay, this is the last crate in the in the magical group of seven. Um, so let's hope it's th let's hope this is the one. If not, we still got thirteen more and trade ups to do. But you never know. A furry, another import. You know what? I'll take it. I'll take these imports. I really will. Um, because I because I can't really trade up endos because of how valuable they are, uh, especially painted ones. So I need furries and tachyons to be able to do import trade ups. And we've got loads. We're gonna have at least two import trade ups, maybe even three. Because of this crate opening. Snake skin, that's a very rare. We haven't had many of those, but we will have quite a few from the rares. I think we'll have two or three very rare trade-ups and then two or three import trade-ups after that. So now we've got those items. Let's just get a mystery decal. Really make this the best. Then we can get a painted endo as well, hopefully. And then maybe a uh, painted Kalos wheel. Those, those are the goals. Painted endo, painted Kalos, or mystery. And Xenosplash can help us towards that cause. So yeah, that's good. That's good. That's why literally exotics in crates, when you open this many crates, are kind of the worst thing. Because you can get normal exotics from a failed import trade-up, so you don't want to get it in a crate. You know what I mean? Um, but anyway, let's keep going. Come on. The Griffin. I feel like I'm owed a freak-out moment. You know, I haven't had a real freak-out moment in a while, where I've really freaked out over something in a crate. I feel like, anyway. That's, that's how it feels for me. Like, yeah. Come on. Cross my fingers for good luck. I've not done this before, but, like, not for Rocket League crate openings. Snake skin. Okay. Now I'll do the double cross. This is supposed to be unlucky, I think, to cross both your fingers. Uh, but we're going to do it. Come on. I'll close my eyes as well. Put my fingers on my temple. Give me the good vibes. <laughs> this is so weird. Xenosplash, okay, a lot of very rares there. All very rare from what I could see. I couldn't quite see the one at the bottom peeking out. Alright, eight more crates. It's been really good, actually. Like, we've had a lot of very rares and imports. I'd rather that than exotics any day of the week, in, in the Turbo series especially. There's just been no painted exotic or mystery decal. <sighs> that was very close. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not surprised. That was so close. Ah, oh, man. Oh, it was literally on the name of Aqueous and Mystery was right below. Endo? I'll take an Endo. Yes, they're still valuable at the moment. They're still valuable. And these are all tradable as well because my keys are tradable. It's a good day. We have it. We're going to have a lot of turbo items after this crate opening because they've all been like we've gained, we've got like 10 imports. That's just insane. I can't comprehend that. That's, that's a lot. That's like one in five now. A roulette wheel. Yeah, see, I'm not, I'm not as gassed about that as an endo or a furry or a tachyon or anything. Um, certified. There we go. See, that's what the orange roulettes look like. They look just like that. That could have said painted and I would have believed it, basically. <laughs> um, come on. Sort us out. You've been alright to us, Rocket League. They've liked the video. A few thousand by this point. So don't give us that. I'm looking up at some clouds. You know, they might be living in the clouds. Um, I'm gonna look, I'm gonna do this next crate entirely looking at the clouds, okay? How many do we have left? We have four. We've opened 50. We've had 10 imports. That's 20% chance of getting an import, which is higher than what it should be, which is great. But a mystery decal would be fantastic. Please. Okay, I think we're getting some dodgy signals. I think you must have misinterpreted my message. Um, Mr. Decal, Suji, they, they sound the same. It's painted black, I think. No, that's not black. That is not black. It looked black in this light, okay? There was, yeah, on the side there, that looked kind of black. It's not black, I'm aware, I know. But guys, help a colorblind guy out. <laughs> Give him no doubt that it's a mystery. It doesn't have to be painted because that, that's not a thing. But, thank you for the aqueous. It's cool. We still got loads of trade-ups to do, and trade-ups kind of I'm starting to become more like the trade-up king than the crate king. My crate luck overall has still been exceptional, but my trade-ups have been pretty insane too, so... Like, I got back-to-back -back three times painted exotics on a stream. Kawhi. 
Uh, I did a C1, C2, and a C3 trade-up. They were all painted uh, exotic, which was awesome. They were all the less valuable ones. It was Photon, Lobo, and Pulsus. So that could have been Looper, Voltaic, and Disco, which would have been a thousand times better. But is this the last crate? I think this might be the last one. This or the next one. We get the vector. I'll take a vector. Okay. Let me think about this. Let me think about this. All right. That's the last one. Okay, right. Let's do all the rare trade-ups. Look at that. Look at this. This is criminal. What color was it? It was, it was Burnt Sienna. Okay. I thought it was, but I didn't want to say it. I, I thought it was after I knew it wasn't black. Put it that way. Painted Septums. That's what we're going for, I guess. But I don't mind the normal stuff because... Let's keep the certified stuff for now and the painted. Then we'll see what we can trade up later on. I will trade up painted decals if I have to because no one really cares about them. I would never wear them. So yeah, that's what we're doing. Trading up everything. Zeno Splash, let's go. Um, Kawaii, get out of my life. Striker Kawaii though, not bad. Breakout Vector, love that. Dominus Suji, trade you. I'll trade you. All right, now let's go with the... I don't like the Aqueous at all. I don't like the Heiwa. Um, I'd rather have the Heiwa than the Suji actually because I sometimes use the Breakout. The Mass Minion I don't have, but it's Striker, so I'll keep it. That's going to be the trade up we do there. And then Zenith Slash. Okay, now we can trade up one more. What should we keep out of all of this? The Victor Dominus Suji Red, 100%. Let's go. Breakout Vector. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, here we go. Now it's time for very rare trade-ups. This is, this is exciting stuff. Okay, let's go down. Septum. Okay, so we've got... We've officially got 7, 4, 14, 50. We've got 3. We can keep 2. I'm going to keep the show-off Vector and a Zeno Splash. That's what I'm going to keep. Oh, I like the snake skin though. Ooh. No, no, I'll keep out the show off vector because it looks nice and the, and the Zenith Splash because I would actually use that. So, <clears throat> the first potentially good trade that we, we have, it could be a painted endo. Let's go! Furry, okay, I genuinely thought for a second that might be a painted endo. Come popping up in our on the screen there. Alright, so. Can we get a painted endo this time? Rocket League Gods, please! A normal endo. Alright, not bad. I bet, you know, let's just get... Let's just have a tachyon then. Painted tachyon, maybe? I'm feeling a painted tachyon. Um, right, vector. No, you know what? We're going to reorganize this. There we go. That looks nice. Vector in the middle with the V, then the Zenith Slash on the sides. That's like the most aesthetically pleasing trade-up I can manage. Can we get a painted endo for that? I think it's going to be a tachyon, but here we go. A furry. Wow, that was very disappointing. Two furries and an endo. But if we look now, look at this. We have seven endos, six furries, and six tachyons. So that's two trade-ups right there, I believe. Two import trade-ups. Let's do a furry trade-up. <clears throat> okay. We haven't got anything painted from trade-ups, so we could get a painted roulette or a painted Kalos wheel. Can we do that? Normal Kalos, that's really not good. This is the last trade-up. Come on, I don't want to trade up without any success. Come on, let's do the goalkeeper and the juggler. We'll keep a furry, have a paragon, tachyon, we'll have our white endo. A striker endo! It was striker! Oh my days! I didn't even notice that! I I said I when it came, when I got endo, I thought it was gonna be certified. Then I said to you, I thought it was gonna be striker, but I wouldn't say that because it never is. Striker endo. That's insane. That, because if, if a normal ender is worth like five keys, that like doubles it at least. I know someone's going to pay a lot of, a lot of dough for that. Um, all right, final, we got, we have all furry trade-up. It was a paint, uh, it was a normal Kalos wheel. If this all tachyon trade-up is going to be a normal roulette wheel, I'll be done. But still a good video nonetheless, definitely. Let's go. Certified roulette wheel. See, not great, not great at all. Let's go to exotics. Look at this, right? There's my painted roulette wheel. Looks basically the same, but I'm gonna end that video there. We got in that it was it was fun. We got a lot of endos. I think that that's the, that's that's what I get in my turbo crate openings. I did the 30 plus turbo crate opening. I got three endos. This one I got like more than that, and I got a striker endo in a crate. That's pretty mad. 
Uh, but that does it for this video. If you did enjoy it and want to see more, then like I said, be sure to leave a like on the video because I'll be checking to see how this video does. Subscribe today to join the Pixel Army. I've been Pixel, you've been awesome, and I'll see you in the next video very soon.